Hi. Hi. How are you? Fantastic. This is my first course and uh, learned a lot about myself. I have so much to... Uh, Love. Yes, of myself, which I put this wall, it sounds like, a, yeah, I know everything, and, but I did a lot of blame instead of looking at myself. But I needed to forgive myself, or I needed to accept myself and not feel that guilt. I'm getting rid of the guilt that I have the others and um, stop blaming others for me not growing. It's your fault, it's your fault. But I wouldn't love myself and I'm learning what love, your, love myself is. And you said, breaking the family curse. And that's, it stops with me and the new spirit starts with me. And you had talked about going to Wasaga Beach and the trees and the positive energy. This is what I get from my garden. I, I get it from my garden. So when your garden gives it to you, then you will create a new garden in your mind so that you can give that to everyone else. But I had a lot of weeds in my garden of myself, the weeds in my soul, the weeds in my thoughts. And I'm pulling those weeds out. 1% every day and 100 days. Give me a break. That's that's 100%. Yeah. And it's up here how you absorb that and how you can communicate to people and be the light for yourself, for yourself. And that people will see the light from you and their children and your family will see the light in you. I can't, you can't, you can bring a horse to water, but baby, you can't make him drink. And, and that includes our spouses. I was a bully. I always did the blame game. I couldn't grow because of what I had inside me. I had a wall, but this wall has come down. And I called him yesterday. He actually planted beans because I didn't have time to plant the beans before I came. He ate salad that was growing in the garden and the onions because they were getting tall. He did that. I, it just blew me away. So it, with me away from him for these days was what he needed from me. You know, this, this, this. Shut my mouth, observe. That's it, and grow and shine. This is the best course. And yes, you'll get um, rejection or whatever you want. I'm stuck for better lack of words. But from the family, the negativity, my sister said to me, but can you, can you absorb all that? <laughs> I said, sure, yeah, it, it's great. Because, and this is what I said to these girls, slow down, I can't absorb, I can't absorb this. I, you know, and you get to, you think in your head subconsciously, you're married to your problem. You're married to, whether it's physical or, you know, whatever. And always talking about it. The more you talk about your, whether it's a disability or whatever, the stronger, where your mind goes, that's the body follows. It's, you carry, your, your emotions carry the disease that, that manifests in your body. This is why I tell you people, this is the course. You'll never find another one like this. I'm saying that from the inner body of myself, you'll never find another course like this. Not because it's, it, it's fact. I feel it in me. This is fact. And people, oh, I'm so sorry you got this disability. Um, 
must be hard for you. No, when I heard Daryl talking his videos and everything, I said to my husband, this is who I need. I need that strong, more than what I am. I like, oh, I, uh, I'm queen, you know, listen to me. But he was challenging for me, and this is what I needed. You know, like, you know, and then people, that's true. People said you were very arrogant. A and who cares? Who cares? You know, m most of my family think I'm loony anyway. So I got used to that, and I never cared. They either loved me or if they didn't. That was their, their thing. choice. Their, it was their choice. But I'm not carrying it. And so if you have, are searching, a lot of people search. They search and search. And there's this gap that doesn't never, I know I can do something. And that's how I felt. I know I was created to do something more. But what was that something? I do believe. I'm telling you, for real. I did not script this. I do believe I have a lot to learn of myself and love myself unconditionally. But how can you help or be the light for someone else if you're not there yourself? So I am a woman. I am strong. And I appreciate all the love. I felt so much love like I never felt before in this atmosphere. So I will not thank you. Uh, it's, it's gratitude. I have lots of gratitude. You're, thank you.